Welcome back to the Gnome Show. This is uh, Josh, your humble host, and tonight I have for you the Trinity Desk Project by Mr. Manticore. Uh, you can also find uh, links to the channels that I watch, um, uh, the analog cha or channels, things like that, uh, on my channel now. Uh, without further ado, uh, let's get into the Trinity Desk Project. Studios, nice. Cryptozoologists love wildfires. The flames burn away the lush tree canopies to reveal the secret animals beneath. But once in a while, the fire reveals something inanimate. The cryptozoologist will call the park ranger, and the park ranger will call the police. When the police arrive, they cling to their Geiger counters and gas masks. Why? For decades, the government withheld information. Witnesses were chained and theorists were hushed. But I come from a world of terror. I know how to find dangerous information. I present to you the facts. I present to you the truth about the Trinity Desk. <laughs>
the stakes are too high for you to stay home. The stakes are too high for you to stay home. The stakes are too high for you to stay home. The stakes are too high for you to stay home. The stakes are too high for you to stay home. The stakes are too high for you to stay home. The stakes are too high for you to stay home. The stakes are too high for you to stay home. The stakes are too high for you to stay home. The stakes are too high. Yes, we're supposed to be. So they were trying to cut down the... Oh, my home didn't dream. <clears throat> we dreaded every day and our history was nightmarish. But when I came to this country, I woke up. Your home has a history of hope. Despite every disaster, the people still dream. The election of 68 perfectly captures this pattern. It's the reason why I've nicknamed your country. I am thankful to live in this steam verse. But there is still so much to learn. Both old and new catastrophes feel less real to me. I must connect with your history. I must ask its unanswerable questions. Why did the government finally declassify footage of the horned serpent's inflamed lung? What aerial phenomena are they continuing to hide at Devil's Tower? Was that the same phenomena recorded on the White House grounds? What is America's true self? And one more question. Where is the Leonard Moreland I knew? Cleveland arrived in New York two days before Christmas. 
Christmas. Inside the sheep, there was so much life, warmth. It insulated her optimism. On deck, there was nothing of the sort. It was cold. It was rainy. It was quiet. In rain, the Statue of Liberty was almost invisible. This was America's welcome. America's cold breath. What's up, Liberty? Imagine an immigrant in New York. No friends, no family. No English. But I wanted a taste of everyone else's action. I ran to a store and bought myself a gift. A snow globe of Lady Liberty. She was underwater. Like a fish. The Statue of Liberty should not be visited. Christmas. I went because I wanted to be American. There is a reason why it is closed. On Christmas Day, they let liberty breathe.
your safety. frequency of the George Hopkins. self we must take action to prevent the public our patients from viewing her true self <clears throat> our patients the Leonard Moreland I knew.
to some shady shit. On a sunny morning in June, a woman took her dog for a walk. They went to the grassy field behind their neighborhood. On this day, the husky would not stop barking at the woods nearby. The woman followed as the dog pulled the leash forward. Snout close to the ground. The dog settled to stay put on one side of the meadow. And began to excitedly dig away at the dirt. As she tried to stop her pet from tearing out more grass, she noticed a video camera in the pit the dog had dug. The camera was clearly buried by someone. She couldn't imagine why. Really? You couldn't imagine why someone would bury was a camera? In good condition. With the exception of a few scratches. She activated the camera and viewed the three clips in its memory. They featured multiple takes of a girl in a NASA shirt, proudly displaying a red folding chair. In the background of each clip, The woman could see distortions in the air, like heat waves running along the tree line. After watching the videos, the woman heard a whimper. She told police that the two invisible men in the footage were responsible. victim what Okay, um, I guess um, we'll get more answers um, um, soon. Um, I'm assuming that little girl is the one that popped over from the other universe. Um, and uh, the guy that was stuck in limbo with her, like his version uh, is uh, in this universe is, is uh, deceased apparently, which kind of sucks. Um, Okay, so we're getting some continuity uh, between the uh, the original and the modern. Okay. All right. Uh, so uh, sound off in the comments, and if you are lost, which I would imagine a lot of you would be, um, um, this is uh, Mr. Manticore. Um, he is the uh, guy that does the monument mythos, uh, both the original and the modern day. <coughs> We've been watching his stuff for quite a while on this channel. Uh, some uh, very old that um, I have to uh, re-record. And um, some of the new ones, uh, which we've been doing on this channel. Um, 
Yeah. So if you want more information or you want to seek out the whole thing, go to Mr. Manta Course channel right here uh, and uh, you can get your fill. Um, like, subscribe and share. Um, be happy, be safe, be healthy. I love you all. And I'll see you in the next one.